Bite Breakers, new playable prototype reveal trailer. Multi player battle royale platform fighter. Uh, battle royale. Oh, is he still making battle royales? As a studio, we'd rather try something crazy and fail than just make a game that you feel like you've already played. It's a scary process, but it's also kind of awesome because taking risks is why we started a brand new studio in the first place. Make a story rich game. Maybe a little crazy. But today we want to show you story rich game make a story rich game if you want to risk it make a story rich game fight breakers and then another battle royale and uh i like characters <laughs> anyway wife was and husband is here look cool but uh I I saw I saw despite battle royals. <laughs> oh, for Christ's sake! Music is nice. <laughs> Blade breakers. We'll all probably be calling this something like a Smash Battle Royale, and let's be real. The polished level right now looks a little ass, but we oh, hope to see the potential. We envision that by taking There's no potential. a multi-team environment, big open map, power progression, information asymmetry, and just general strategic decision making of BRs, smashing those together with solid fundamentals from Smash, we can let players have wild experiences that they'd never find in a straight-up platform fighter. Parts of it will feel familiar, but we hope that as a whole, it's a new experience. So to call out the elephant in the room, making a platform fighter is scary. You're going to always be compared to one of the greatest gaming series of all time. A story us, rich a game a better smash that people will play it for the story and characters. At the end of the day, find a capable screenwriter. What matters is what you think of the game. Does it feel fun and unique when you play it? Is it something you could see yourself playing with your friends? Or should we even be making this thing or should we just go next? With Omega Strikers, we learned firsthand the risks of keeping things under wraps for too long. And we felt the pain of having to move on from something that we poured three years of our passion into. For all of our next projects, we want to hear what you think much, much earlier. So, in a few days, we're going to start up a playtest on Steam where we let a few thousand of you in to try out the prototype. It's fully public, so feel free to talk about it with your friends, make videos about it, or even stream it. We want to hear what you honestly think. To get in, just go to the Steam page for Byte Breakers and request playtest access. From there, we'll be letting groups of players in as we make sure that the server infrastructure is scaling because well, that part of the project's kind of a prototype too. So to make sure that we're super clear on expectations, we may not end up actually making this prototype. We may not end up making the next prototype we show you either, but we think that this type of public testing is the best way of figuring out if our ideas have juice. We trust you oh boy. and we trust your feedback. So get in there and let us know what you think. No. Finger guns. <laughs> Oh man.